Good morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this. Today, I want to tell you don't buy three, two, three, Brill Plus machine yet until you watch with watch these videos. Okay, if I'm seldom do reveal for 3D printers. Even last time I tried in the Creality Enders and 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 CR10S Pro, I don't really do review. And I don't say that bad, I don't say that good, I know what's happened, I just don't want to use it, I sell it out. And today I get another because I have no printer to use it, I full up full operating. I need some more replacement to some small thing for my own. And then I give it a, I, I found this thing. This is called uh, from a company called Two Three, number two and a three. So this is a company brand, kind of easy. But the printer name is a little bit weird. Because in Chinese, there are actually blue wheel. Then I read this, uh, I don't know how to read it. Blue, blue. Oh, I just got it. So maybe there's a sound of the blue wheel when the water come out from the head. Well, it doesn't matter. Talking about the 3D printers itself. It's running here is because now it's dark shadow. You might not see it clearly. I will show it up the process of open box everything later. I don't want to waste your time. I want to say the good thing and bad thing before all these things happen behind. First thing, say about good thing. You everything need to know. I you, you don't actually I don't have to say too much about good thing. The hardware is really good. Even is um, made by in China, but actually you know iPhone is made in China. China got the ability to make a lot of good stuff. But is limited to hardware. Yes, it's hardware. They put the best hardware in here. Um, maybe not the best, uh, maybe cloned, like 3D touch, automatic calibration sensor, right? Then you got a uh, volcano hot end, and you, I'm not sure this is met all metal, full metal or not, I don't care. And you got a, a special spring to hold the view, so it can always lock. You put a sparing on both of the Z list glue, so make sure that it rotate together. Of, but that is a little bit over. But never mind, everything to over is better and they got a very easy panel. You just go to search this printer, you will see their uh, officer video and tell all the good stuff. So, good stuff. Everything they talk about. Hardware. But what about software? This is the place, that's why I ask you, hold on before you buy. If, if you like me, honestly, you see it's working, right? It worked like charms, no problem. But I don't think if you are the first, this is your first 3D printer, you will win it work. Because um, on the screen right side, I see that it's a Cura. Okay, before that, I want to say that, okay, I've, I, I tried. No, nope, assembly this thing, you don't have to read. For me, I don't have to really watch the, the, the handbooks or tutorial the assembly. The, it's just basic of 3D printing. It's just machine. Just see, see the thing, you know where to put if you do it before. If you don't know, uh, you can still watch the book, see what's the step or some... I, I saw one video out there that's showing out the, how to do this, so I don't have to repeat that anymore. I put the link in the description if you did it. But after assembly the hardware done, what's, what's next? Okay, you start the loss because no one talk about it at all. For newbies, if you're doing you handle with this kind of machine, you don't have any experience on software, damn it, it's collecting dust right now. But you need to spend time asking a lot of people. But the community of this printer is so little. I say pity because you go to their website, they don't talk about detail, they just keep doing marketing, sell, telling how good, good is this, but still skipping the step like don't tell you the software. Well, in fact, I got actually the inside the uh, Pen drive, it, they, they do provide some in thing. Uh, it's here. Oh, this is the pen drive file. I just extrude it. So you got a software and instruction. This is simple is because they put Mandarin or uh, Chinese. I can because a uh, computer cannot read it. Um, optional, but it's error. Oh, but one thing you realize this is the file I copied di direct from the pen drive. It's called Bula, not Bula. Okay, I'm not trying to read it. I know I'm bad on that. Um, that's okay. You see, they got two options for you. One is a uh, Kira, another is a Rapid Horse. So I tried the Kira. I do the thing, follow it. Um, 
I had to know how they work, right? So I read all this tutorial and then load it up. Of course, they are Cura is a little bit outdated. It's fine, and yeah, then you got see you can see this uh, machine setting. Well, I saw that put all this. Yeah, I'm not sure the software engineer two three if you're watching. Do you really know what all this could work like? Because if you put this into your machine, it's not working. It will like cranking the extruder, overloaded, in, and then filament won't load at all. I watch it, so I, after the testing, I've come back to here, I don't use it anymore. I go back to my own slicer, it's, not, it's a simplified 3D. We do, we do the modification for our own machine, always, because you don't want that to be crazy. And you go, uh, code here, no, 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 script. Okay, this, to start, start script, you just need a simple few line. I, tr I do put the automatic calibration inside, but every time your machine run all the autom automatic calibration before start, it's not going to the main screen, which means it's supposed to go to the print. When you're doing printing, it's supposed to go in the screen showing printing temperature, printing time, and bad temperature, like a file name, or, and you can stop the print anytime, that kind of screen. But once you put in the automatic calibration before start, the printing not working because it's somehow hanging in the sky or just stack it stack on the automatic calibration screen, like you're doing automatic calibration. I think someone do it online, but this video is very long. I uh, to show his frustrating. I I can feel him, but I don't want to watch all his frustrating. I know what happening. Basically, I can guess is from the firmware issue. But never mind. Let's make it work first. Again, what I say just now, if you don't, un you don't understand at all, which means you are first time to this, you don't buy this printer. You buy Prusa. Why? They have all detailed handbook, include the software tutorial, and the software is work like few more buttons. You know, you just understand how all this setting work. Even you don't understand, you. By default, you put the models in. As long as you can set up the support or right orientation, you can print something out, no problems. Okay, unless your assembly issue. Okay, that's another thing. But I'm talking about the community of Prusa. It's really good. I don't really say think good like that because I'm using so much. You know, I want to claim that they're not sending in any free machine. They're not sending. They're not. They're not giving me a. Uh, any any monies this is not a sponsor i just buy it for myself put in my workshop to use it and for people for and also i help people to build the machine i build a lot of them until i don't have to watch their tutorial that their, their, their printer is really built from scratch every screw you need to assembly every single wires you need to assemble yourself make yourself easier to understand everything that is for newbie that's really for newbies you you spend time to learn for this type of thing, sound like oh, you can boom ten minute install finish unbox until ten until the machine finished install. Uh, I think not more than ten minute, and after that you just spend like uh, maybe fifteen minute adjust all the uh, the bad thing, screw thing, make sure the level thing, and then make it automatic leveling. Your setup is done, but to make it run to print. You need to have extra experience on 3D printing, especially in software. So I will put this G code. If you have this printer and you're not making it work, I put this starting G code. Every slicer, before that, every single slicer that got starting script and ending script. Okay? Don't make it so complicated. You see their all original code. Uh, I closed it already, sorry. Never mind. You see the original code is quite complicated. We got a lot of like. Um, convert this and that but most of them is not necessary because the printer itself is stored all the memory inside and no is it mm is it what is that control but you reset it it will conflict with the hard with the with the firmware the firmware is the software and the printer to operating right okay once that thing crazy um, you cannot stop the print you cannot control you cannot leveling it can't do anything like the baby step cannot do so what I suggest is if you got this one, first thing you go to the menu at 
access or make it automatic leveling. After that, you do manual, baby step. But if you don't move the printer, it will work like normal, unless you shake it or the bed moving movement too much or the screw loose. After all these things, only you can use it. So why? So what? So I say that. I say so. Another thing is, it, this is one that is really make, make me frustrating. But because I know this from an issue, and you go to their website. If you go to Prusa, you're searching Prusa firmware. You see the first one I search. I as always search, and you get the, the their website. You got the link. You got very detail on in on on this all models and firmware. Always the latest one that got updated to the or oh, the last one is November twenty four. You see update. They have the whole work, whole bunch of machine the running the, in the farm and print the printer part themselves. That's why they notice, and any happening they noticed and they they just upgrade the firmware and share it immediately to you. Not really immediately, but after they fully test it work and share it to you, then you can simply just go download download. But if this is the 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 tr two three website, okay? They have products that sell all the printers this and that. They have common detail. They got news, but you see, but when you go to download firmware download, they come to page like this. Square test configuration file. Well, basically, is for you see, they're not mentioned any printer models, or obviously they are not same. Okay, they got so many printers right now, and also like laser cutters, uh, laser engraver, and go back to here. And then you get stuck technical support. Uh, what the heck is this? Common failure. Okay, it's a it's a PDF files and a lot of bundle text. Firmware update. Rep Robin Nano Sharpie Fast is an another old 3D printers and the files like old. And the printer I received this is like firmware is uh one point something version. And I hear that someone say they already have two point two plus. But I can't see anyone download it because, and I also I asked someone. They said, uh, the official website uh, people send through the Facebook, but I he don't not he don't have the file now. And they cannot send to me. So I asked. I tried to ask from their Facebook. Um, maybe it's Nike. Uh, no one replied. I tried to find from their official website. Don't have. They don't put on top here. This is the most important phase of yours. Yeah, information. You're in. Why don't you put it up there? And also, your your include the files. F the the models need a different with the original one. It's called blur. Then you come out, the product become blur. What is the which is the real name? Is it blur or blur? Whatever. Confusing, right? I say I repeat, China is rich. I'm not saying to do that. Bad. They're making stuff very low cost and affordable, very nice, good for tech, good good for all the hardware, but the software part really kind of something. Okay, until now I think you know what I'm talking about. More than thirteen minutes now. I don't want to be dragging video so long. I will stop the video here. For next video, I will share the unboxing uh, assembly detail. In case you need it, because in case you already brought it, I you don't know what to do, and I will share the code uh, in description somewhere. I maybe next video where during the installation. So, um, if you got any question, well, feel free to ask me as well. I try to compact all the questions through the, the suppliers together. So uh, hopefully, they can notice these problems, and. I can say that not only this company have this problem, even Creality, top sales already, they still have this trouble. You, you want to find upgrade firmware, this and that. Like my, I have one uh, CR10S Pro. I totally modded out now. I don't even use that original firmware now. But you want to find update for that? It's like crazy hard. No, uh, for Ender Tree is good because a lot of community give out. Uh, free uh, time to upgrade all the thing, then you can find a lot of information from out there, not from the officer. Okay. <sighs> yeah, China people that care about okay fast make fast money.
honestly. I think so. Uh, if you're saying it's wrong, it's no need to argue. This is what I'm thinking. And that keep doing stuff low cost, lower, lower, and, and try to make higher sales, but without focusing on the software. You see phone like that. You see 3D, all the other 3D printers like that. You see all the physical product like that. And in fact, they can't do because in environment make them like this. Not 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 they really want it. But in in thing in this thing, um, th I found on the very interesting part uh, thing is they give a blue wild uh wallet kind of stuff is as an extra gift. Why do you did that? Is that it really interesting? I wish you can get the money, hire some user interface de designer or or really good uh, UI designer and. No, it's supposed to user experience people, okay? Make them de de design the user experience, people, how to find your company, how to uh, facing problem, how to solve. What is the important, what is the key thing of a 3D printer? You, s you just go to see Prusa how they do. They do it really great. They upgrade everything. And you, you know that you, you buy their printer, you won't be ha have any trouble. You, you, instead of giving all this junk out there, I was gonna just throw it away because no, no, nobody would use kind, that kind of stuff. Okay, waste the money. I know that's not cost much in China, but come on, you take all the the manufacturing money, hire maybe one or two you 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 experienced people, just do it. Sorry, I'm out of topic. I'm supposed to tell the the audience about this now because I talk to. Two, three directly because I'm so frustrating now. Um, of course, uh, you see my printers work well. I'm frustrating not because it's not working, just because how the experienced people will access to your company, to your firmware, to your maybe library, to the information, how this work, uh, how the code work. This one worked because I changed the G code from start G code and NG code. NG code. I'm not. I'm not finished one print yet, so I don't know if any trouble will happen later or not. But most of most likely, I use the same G code for my CR10X Pro. That will be fine. But I remove the automatic calibration issue because of the firmware. If I want to fix it, I may need to spend some time to open up and check. Maybe we update the firmware for myself. Maybe using Marlin too. But as a print, as a company like you, a bit, a, a, try to sell big and keep doing more marketing. You're doing too, so badly and people will come back to say this is bad. Well, just ruining your own reputation. It's not a printer issue. It's a, it's a people, it's a software, it's how you think, how to access all the things. You can't find a printer firmware from internet. Even Chinese, okay. I, do, I I am Chinese speaker. I do I do read Chinese. I go to Chinese website. I can't find any, okay. Okay, nah, stop, stop it. Uh, see you next video for the detail unboxing on the trip printers thing. Since I already did it, so I will release it as well. Thank you for watching and see you next video. Bye.